हेलो एवरीवन एंड वेलकम टू पहले अक्षर वर्चुअल क्लासरूम आई होप यू ऑल आर सेफ इन योर होम्स एंड एंजॉइंग आवर वर्चुअल सेशंस थिंक अबाउट द टाइम व्हेन यू हैव ओपन द बेस्ट गिफ्ट यू हैव एवर रिसीव्ड यू मे फेल्ट योर स्टमक फ्लिप योर हार्ट मे हैव स्टार्टेड रेसिंग फास्टर एंड योर फेस प्रोबेबली टर्न टू स्माइल व्हाट यू एक्सपीरियंस आर हैप्पीनेस एंड एक्साइटमेंट दीज are what we call emotions emotions are a strong feeling deriving from one circumstances mood or relationships with others for example when your best friend is leaving the city and moving to some other city you may experience the emotion of sadness if you smell something yucky in the garbage can you might experience the emotion of disgust Psychologists say that we have only six basic emotions which are happiness anger sadness fear surprise and disgust all other emotions are built from this six basic emotions basic emotions can be felt by all living things not just humans have you ever seen a dog wag its tail this is how a dog shows joy However there are other emotions that are higher emotions such as shame guilt and pride these are only experienced by human beings and a few other animals species emotions are completely natural and always keep changing how are the emotional responses triggered a system is located deep within our brain that is responsible for behavioral and emotional responses This system is called the limbic system. Whoa, that's too heavy to understand, right? Let me make it simple. What exactly happens inside the body when we express emotions? When we are feeling a strong emotions, chemicals are released into our brains and the brain gives instructions to your body to react. A body can react in three different ways. One part of this emotion emotional reaction is that some routine functional of our body changes. For example, when you are scared, frightened or angry, you might feel your heart beat faster and you also start choking if you are talking. You don't get the right words. When you are joyful or pleased, you might smile. Your voice might sound more excited and you might stand up a bit taller and you might not even notice you are doing this things students have you ever felt this emotions or reacted to a situation with strong emotions let us know about in on our whatsapp group another part of an emotional reaction is that you see things around you the same way as you feel imagine that you are watching a horror movie a scary ghost comes on the screen There is a pin drop silence and suddenly you experience a hand on your shoulder You're scared sweating and you look back in fear and that's your mother because you were watching a ghost on the TV you were scared and you thought that the hand on your shoulder might be a ghost hand have you ever experienced this on the other hand when people feel confident and positive they usually feel good about everything around them the last part of an emotional reaction is that you would behave differently than you usually do for example if you are frustrated you might want to yell or fight with someone on the other hand if you are thrilled you would want to party to help even a stranger i do most of the above what about you how do you react in the above emotions Share with us on WhatsApp feelings are in response to different thoughts and situations. For example, imagine two people visit a neighbor's house and this neighbor has a dog. One person might think this dog is this dog could hurt me and feel scared. This might be because he might have had a bad experience with a dog in the past. The other person might instead think Oh what a cute dog and feel happy this could be because he has had no 
good or experience with a dog in the past. This shows how if two people have had different experiences, they might have different thoughts and emotions in the same situation. Have you watched this movie Inside and Out? It's an animated movie. Please do watch. You all will love it. So students, we should be glad that we can have so many different emotions because without them, every day we would feel the same. So, we should respect every feeling of ours and where every individual is different and have different feelings. Before I end this video, I would like to remind you to share and subscribe to our channel. So, here I am bidding you goodbye. See you in the next video with lots of fun. So, stay home and stay safe. Bye-bye.